prosperous part of the world, but there's people living on zero hours contracts, people who can't make ends meet because of the rent going up and up and up, and it's tragic. And I, I this is going to sound like I'm a bad loser, and maybe I am, but I can't help but feel that the people of Uxbridge and South Rysalip have fallen for the cult of celebrity. They've elected a show pony to replace a workhorse. So John Randall is a fantastic MP, a proper constituency MP, and he is being replaced by somebody who, although he talks about endless hard work, I really doubt that he's going to do any of that. And you are... But you must respect democracy, and obviously I respect the democratic choice of the uh, voters who have uh, voted for Boris Johnson as their candidate and the MP for Uxbridge and South Rysley. But uh, I will uh, just say that the people here, I, I, I remind you of the uh, Emperor's New Clothes, the uh, Hans Christian Andersen song, uh, Tale. I, I feel much like the, the child in that story who's constantly selling people, can't you see, he's naked, he's not wearing anything, he does not wear in this magnificent clothes. But people just can't see it, they're, they're falling constantly for the Boris Johnson myth. So yes, I feel like I, I sound like a bad leader, I some clues, but I'm sure people out there and the people who voted for me know that it's true. Thank you very much. 22,000. Thank you.